will make it stand up with a knife. Mix this up. Put juice over here. Just right there in this pocket. So you have hamburger, onion, garlic, garlic butter cheese soup, the pasta, a little bit of mustard. And cook it at, we're cooking it on the stove at five and a half. We have whole egg, white egg noodles, cheddar cheese, pasta. This going in it? No. What's this? Premium cheddar. Is it going in it? Yeah. And premium cheddar. Um, is there anything else to cut? Um, Wait, should I get this next and put it down and check to see if it needs more onion? Um, this is not. It's okay. Because your mother's not on work yet. On my screen, it, the stove, where it's red, it was purple. Really? Uh huh. If you move the pot, it's purple. Oh, wow. Cool. Here's stuff a bit. Careful because it might splash you. And you're mixed in for a little while. You want that creamy brown right there. Darker. Dark brown. already starting to get some dark brown here. Right there. Just all dark brown. Don't forget to wash your hands. Should be done in about 20 minutes. We're adding cheese to this. Oops. Well, I'll just rinse that off. No, just get a new one. Spoon. Spoon? Yeah. Everybody here like peas? Yes. Really made a huge difference.
Yeah, that's a lot of brown right there. Yep. It's cooking real fast. I'm going to turn it down to four. Careful, it's a hot stove. Then you want to get your piece started up. Right up there. Keep the keep the keep on mixing. Okay. You want to get that really nice brownish color. Right now it's only at four. Make sure you keep checking it. Might need some more onion. Just a bit. It is. Bunch of juice. I will have to stop. Can I pop it in? Yeah, it might be kind of hot. I'm good. I burnt my hands on the stove real bad. I actually put my hand on my dad's stove and it and it doesn't say hot. I burnt my hand. Wow. I've even splashed my arms and my face. Oh, not good. I'm good. I even played basketball once and scarred myself right there. Mm -hmm. <sighs> Let's see. You know the nursery rhyme, there was an old woman who lived in a shoe, she had so many children, she didn't know what to do. No, I know. It goes on, but this is called Lady in the Shoe Spaghetti. Okay, if there's still some gold pieces, cold. Because then it, the thing will heat them up. By now you want to start getting your plates or bowls and forks and spoons set up. The more you get it cut up and browned, the better it will stay away from, sit, keep away from reconnecting. Start out with two and a half pounds of meat. So one pound of meat. You'll mix it in together, you chop it up, put it at five and a half Fahrenheit. You wait a ten, like two minutes. You pop in some butter. No, not butter. But you pop them in. And then you cut them up. <laughs> chop them up with your spatula or spoon. And then with your peas, I'm just going to use a spoon. Table spoon. Yeah. No. I mean, serving. No, no. Serving. Serving. These big ones? Mm -hmm. Okay. So you can use a serving spoon and check them. Ours right now are pretty stuck. I'm just gonna leave it. I'll take it so instead of just taking them out right away, you might want to figure out what you're gonna use. And that juice, 
It's just grease. So you still I still have some pink in here, so I'm gonna keep on going. Maybe turn it down just a smidge. I have it now at three and three quarter. It's juicy meat. Can I get the boiler started? Pot. Oh, the pasta. Because it will take a water. It will take yes. a while. But so then you come over here to boiling water. Um, that's that. Oh, you've already turned it on. You haven't turned oh, on the peas. The on. Nope. Not. Wait. No, you turned on the peas. And it. Let's turn it. See, front. You've already turned it on. It'll just take a while, apparently. But this started much later because it was grease. But do not add grease into your water. Bad idea. So, sprinkle some salt down in there. Stir it around to make a climate change. Well, water change in the temperature. It's only been 12 minutes in. It's doing pretty good. Yep. I turned it down to three so it doesn't burn the Water. other. Yeah, and burn because there's only a bit of pink. So it doesn't go like too hard. Mm hmm. And always keep your spoons away from the inside. Right. Now we have I rinsed the cans off in case there was any bad particles on there. That is a good idea to do that. I can't get that. Because I hold my camera in one hand. Mm -hmm. I think my right hand will be better. Put your thumb. Let me show you. I won't do it. You put one finger in there and you put your thumb there and push with your thumb and pull with this finger. So, what you did was finger, mm -hmm. thumb, push and pull. But if you're right-handed, okay, you did pretty good. It's actually, that's very tiny. It doesn't look like it'll fit on it, but it will. Because it was inside the edge. So we have our pus, our shredded cheese, and our cheese, our uh, premium cheese. They look sort of the same sauce, but they look sort of the same. So don't get these mixed up. That will be very bad. This one has the cheese, the premium cheese has more of a creaminess to it than the cheddar cheese. Sh cheddar yeah. cheese. One's a soup. Um, then One's you'll, a sauce. right now, uh, we have bubbles at the bottom, meaning it will start to boil. Just for extra precaution, you don't want these big bubbles popping. So if you do see one, just stir around. Uh, let's check these peas. They're going pretty good. They're not. Um, yeah, our meat is looking pretty good right now. I don't see no pink. Just for extra precaution, I'm going to check around. Okay, I'm going to keep them yes. warm. I'm going to keep them warm, but I'm not going to have them on. So I'm going to put it at low. Um, this has more of a wobble to it. It has more of a stiff like to it. Um, we are using wide egg noodles. You don't have to use those. And see, it's starting to bubble up. 
splash. Try to get over here. It's really hot. Mix it around, help that bubbliness. Make sure to always check your peas, because if they look like this, you can just tap them very gently. They'll break off. So just flip them. That has ice all over the bottom. Don't worry, though. She did it last time. She can help. Who? I'm talking to Hannah. Oh. Yeah, I said, don't worry about it. Oh. She can help. Yeah, we might need Dude, some more. What are you doing? Making a video of me cooking. And by now, the water is boiling. You're, uh, I don't even know why mom gave you YouTube channel. Hey, Connor. Hey, Connor. Hey, Connor. Hey, hey, Wanna help? Here. Okay, <gasps> you should have scooted over. Don't hit that button, because that'll stop it. 